If you're like me, you probably wonder how other riders out there can afford brand new mountain bikes that cost upwards of $10,000, sometimes more. Heck, even $3,000 is a lot. I work in this industry and I still don't even understand. In fact, the only time I bought a brand new mountain bike at full retail was back in 1994. I got a Gary Fisher Tassahara and my wisdom at the time said, shop, take off those rapid fire shifters and put some Dior friction thumb shifters on the bike. Since that bike purchase, the internet came around and I eventually bought every other bike or component secondhand. Working in the bike industry now for a while, I'm in the unique position of being able to get a new bike at below retail cost if I really want one. But most of you don't have that luxury. I guarantee that if I wasn't working in this biz, I would be buying used all the time. And that's where the pros closet comes in. They asked Vital if we'd go through the process of getting one of their certified pre-owned mountain bikes, having it shipped to our door, and riding it on the trail. We said heck yes, and interestingly enough, back when I lived in Boulder in the mid-2000s, I remember the pros closet coming out as a new shop on the north end of town that would buy and sell used gear. Well, times have changed. I was blown away to see how massive they are. They have so much infrastructure that they've dedicated to receive and inspect potential bikes that they may buy from sellers which that's something you could do. You could sell your used bike to the pros closet. If a bike is accepted from a seller, it gets a full head to toe treatment. Every certified pre-owned bike that's for sale has passed their 141 point inspection. Frame integrity is verified. All components are inspected. Drivetrain is cleaned and tuned. Wheels are trued. They do whatever it takes necessary to get the bike ready for the trail. Vital is given the chance to pick any bike from their certified pre-owned lineup, which is huge, have it shipped to our door so we could shred, just like you would do if you bought a bike from them. Now, in the haste of such excitement, I forgot to screen record the actual bike we chose, but this process is the same, even though it's not the bike we have shipped to our door. Browse their inventory. You can narrow down by price or brand or travel or wheel size. Remember, 27.5 ain't dead. You dig in, you check out the photos, which are of the actual bike you're buying. They're photos that were taken at the Pros Closet Studio. You can contact a Pros Closet ride guide or a support member if you have any questions. And besides the security of their 141 point inspection, they have a 30 day money back guarantee, which you're not going to find that on Craigslist or Facebook or any other buy and sell kind of marketplace. So we'll cruise around. We found a bike, add it to the cart. You can see the shipping cost, which at the time of this video looks like it's about $95 in the USA. It may be different depending on where you live. And then you check out securely, just like any other shopping on the internet. A few days later, a big box with the pros closet on the side shows up and you're off to the races. Unpacking and assembly was a breeze and most riders should have no problem assembling the bike out of the box, especially since the pros closet includes tools. The Trek rail we chose went together just fine. And while it definitely showed signs of use, the imperfections were just cosmetic. Shifting was crisp, the brakes were on point, and it was a hoot shredding this beast. Now, we have to send this bike back because we just got it for the video. But if we bought this bike on the trail, there wasn't any concern about the bike's durability or the condition. It was ridden with confidence, and if I was booted out of the business and was looking to change up bikes in my life, I'd definitely go the second-hand route, and the first place I'd probably start would be the Pros Closet. If you want to cruise their huge pile of certified pre-owned bikes, hit up theproscloset.com. And if you're into some mountain bike vintage history, check out their YouTube channel. They have a super cool series where they bring in really old bikes, they unpack them, they talk about them, and they get some of the history from some of mountain biking's earliest pieces. Let us know in the comments, do you prefer to buy used? Would you rather buy new? What do you think of the pros closet and what they're offering? No matter what, hope you're getting some ride time, and we'll see you on the trails.